start the day by cutting one of these C channels down. Let's get this measured and cut. Subscribe! Oh yeah. He's okay. It's okay. Woo! Literally just fucking barely is this gonna work. I'll take it. Yep. So what Josh is doing now is he's going to weld the tab on so we got something to temporarily hold the C-channel as it goes across. This is kind of an odd design, but another column wasn't placed there because of the stairway that leads up from down there and up into the bottom story of this apartment complex. Is that clamp on their fucking milk. Oh, yeah, it probably is. good yeah I spent about a hundred dollars a day getting here and going back while Josh is getting this welded I'm gonna go over there grab our three inch angle and start figuring out where we need to cut it we need to run three inch angle horizontally or whatever which way that is in between the C channel. What you didn't see me do was go over there and measure between the pieces of C channel to come out with 115 and an eighth for all three of these pieces that are going in. So my phone done fucked up, but what we ended up doing off camera, after you see me cut those 115s, we tack weld those in. Josh is up there welding them right now. And I went ahead and measured the flat side to the flat side. And those were all 30 inches because we use this thing called a measuring tape. And I went ahead and cut all nine of those. Now, for the challenging part, the double coped sides, I need to go up there and measure the ones that are between the inside flange of the angle and the inside flange of the C-channel. So this is gonna be a real bitch because I'm gonna have to cope those and notch them all out. God damn it. All right guys, after struggling with the tape measure to make my marks up top where my cross pieces go, I went ahead and on Josh's suggestion, he was like, go grab you a piece of that there TIG wire out of my box cut it to length, no he don't sound like that, and cut it to length 
and then just use that. Way easier than a floppy ass tape measure because he kept flopping down on me, it was a bitch. So I'm just gonna use this, I'm gonna go ahead and stick it up there, make my marks. Should make it a lot easier. Do they come in here? Oh. Weird. It's just my job, five days a week. All right, Josh is starting to weld in our cross members over there. I'm gonna go over to the forklift and start cutting more material for the opposite side cross members. What do you think, Josh? Over it. Over it. Fucking over it, bro. Want some granola? No granola? 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 Uh, no. How about a granola bar? We're not sponsored by Chewy. Fuck Chewy, we're not here, I'm covering it. We're not giving them no sponsorship dollars. What about a granola bar? Josh just had his fill for the day. Remember kids, welding pays well, but being an internet clown pays better. All right, so I've got all of my pre-cuts done. I just need to notch that shit out and then we're gonna start hanging it. Josh has got most of the angle iron that I already cut welded in. Looks pretty good. He won't let me weld anything. He says I'm a shitty welder. He's kind of right. Anthony's fucking squad jumping my shit hundred fucking he says, I'm, he says I'm trash. Go give him a review. No, I'm just kidding. Don't do that. Don't do that. I mean, you're going to leave some good reviews. What I'm going to do is simply take a piece of the drop C channel and just trace it out onto each of my pieces of angle. So that way everything slips in nice and smooth. There's no issues. We don't have to worry about nothing. I just showed you guys that did. Came out pretty good. There's a little bit of a gap. A little bit, about, probably a little gray dent. The same here. It's probably a little crooked in there. But as you can see, it fits up pretty well. It's just a pain in the ass to do nine of these. All right. Getting there. All right. So I've got what we done. As you can see, it's kind of a weird fucking cut. But that's because we got to slip it underneath of the angle and the C channel there. Josh has done a good bit of the welding. But yeah, everything's wrapping up for the day. Josh is just putting some final touches on some shit. Um, I'm gonna start putting my shit in my truck and getting ready to get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here.